Sabi ko, di kaya po sa yun. Di, lakas eh. Lakas ang pagkakasalong talaga pag sa... Bulat nga ako eh. Hello? Yes, hello sir. Can you uh, uh, quickly uh, uh, repeat the the process again? Because there is something I forget to do. Yes, I I didn't see it yet, sir. Let's copy this item number. Sir, I can't see your screen. You can't see it? Not yet. See now? Mm. Not yet, sir. It's okay now. You can see it now? Yes. Okay. So yeah, we'll just, we just get this item right here. Okay. Um, so I, I got the eBay item ID. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm gonna go to Web Seller Guru, and, and I'm gonna, I'll go to this eBay, our eBay products tab, okay? Okay. And then from there, we can just put in our this the item ID number that we just got, and we can search for it. Okay. All right. So when we search for it, uh, you know, if you want, you can even just click right here, and it'll, it'll actually bring up the, you know, where the source. So this is a Lowe's item. So what we want to do is we want to go to this gear box, this little little box next to the number. We're going okay. to click there, and then we're going to go to change. Okay. Okay. We'll select change. It's going to bring. Then we have to select the source again. So we're going to select. So so I always I would click right. You no, know, or sometimes we may not know if we're using Home Depot or Lowe's or Walmart, right? Yes. So uh, so now we know we got to select Lowe's. So we need to find Lowe's. And then we'll hit save. And then it's going to bring up the box where we do our margins. But this is where we want to update because this is where it's been changing. So. Now, all right, so remember, for Lowe's and Walmart, okay, we'll make the profit, we'll do, do uh, 13. Okay. Then over here, this for other taxes, we're going to put that 12. 12. Okay? Yes. So, so for no matter what, if it's Lowe's, Home Depot, uh, Walmart, this will always be 12, okay? Okay. And then for Lowe's and Walmart, the profit will be 13. But for Home Depot, the profit will be 3. Okay. Okay? Yes. All right. And then, uh, especially for, well, if for Home Depot, just make sure that we're moving forward select the standard shipping instead of free shipping, okay? Okay, sir. And so, yeah, if it's a Home Depot automation, we change that, and then we just hit save. So we'll do that for all these I all, uh, all the new items that are that are being sold. And I want to say I've done it for, like, a couple of these items. I think you could probably start... I want to say you could probably start after. I think I updated this item, so I think any like I, all the you can start like <clears throat> like with these items with like these four items. Okay, sir. Okay. Yes. And then like any new items that we, that we get sold, we want to update those as well. Okay. Okay, sir. All right. All right. Is it? Uh, do you have any questions? None. Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank Have you. a good day. Bye-bye.